Following the issuance of vaccines recently to Prime Minister Dr. Keith Mitchell and health officials on Friday and frontline workers on Tuesday, concerns were raised over why Grenada is using the AstraZeneca vaccine, which has been turned away by some international countries. Acting Chief Medical Officer in the Ministry of Health, Dr. Sean Charles, says these countries have suspended the use of that particular vaccine with reason. When countries make decisions for different reasons, right? does not necessarily have to be have to do with the fact that um, there is an issue with the vaccine. Now, I am aware that South Africa will not be using it or they've taken the decision to not to not use it because um, there was a small study that was conducted in, uh, conducted there and it showed that against the variant that is circulating in South Africa, right, there was minimal um, um, efficacy, all right? Meaning that the, 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 there, was, there was minimal, the vaccine was minimally effective at protecting persons from, from a moderate to severe disease in South Africa. What we must be aware of is that there are a number of variants of the COVID-19 um, virus that are circulating in the world. Responding to reports of a fake vaccine and distribution originating from China, Dr. Charles said the vaccine Grenada received has been approved by the World Health Organization. The vaccine that we have in supply is the AstraZeneca vaccine. Remember, there are many vaccine candidates out there, all right? It is the AstraZeneca vaccine. It is the same vaccine that was granted um, approval by WHO, you know, emergency for emergency use on Monday is the AstraZeneca vaccine. It's a vaccine that was developed between AstraZeneca and University of Oxford in the UK. The vaccine is produced in the Serum Institute of India, which is the largest vaccine manufacturing facility in the world. All right, the largest vaccine manufacturing facility in the world. Many of the vaccines from the COVAX facility, this is where the vaccines are made. The World Health Organization on Monday listed AstraZeneca and Oxford University's COVID-19 vaccine for emergency use, widening access to the relatively inexpensive shot in the developing world. The vaccination is free of cost and is not mandatory to the public. For GBN News, Beverly Tellisford.